who say hi. So I'm not properly introducing myself. So can I just give you a brief history of me? So start off on a very good day and a year that I'm not telling you. I was born in a hospital. Well then, well, some of my earliest memories I have in 2008 when I went on holiday to Spain at the age, no, two, sorry, sorry, again, 2007 when I went on holiday to Spain and 2008 when I went on holiday to Spain again when I was two and a half and three and a half. It was a very enjoyable holiday, I must say. And another notable memory was early 2008 mid 2008 um august of 2008 when i joined nursery and i also remember the day i joined school on august 22nd 2010 that was a nightmare oh i don't like school but um also i've got quite a lot of memories that i need to share with you so memory number one this is when i discovered youtube in fact when i discovered the internet I discovered the internet at a very young age of um, about four years old. Basically, my mum had a very old Windows XP from 2001 by Microsoft, and I used to watch Fireman Sam on it, because I used to be obsessed um, with that when I was a very little kid. But my interest has since changed into novels, such as Harry Potter, a classic example, gaming, such as Minecraft, and also music, such as Meatloaf. So, oh yeah, why do I like Meatloaf? I can explain it. When I was four, my dad bought me a record player and he bought me Back Out of Hell on record. Yeah, this amazing album on record. And yeah, he also bought me Ultra Books, which is an amazing band. And that was a very good day. Introduced me to the world of music. And me all of ever since. No, not the food, the singer. And so, uh, I mean, I got my own computer at the year of five. I got my mum's Windows XP. One day, a friend, which is no longer a friend, Cameron, um, came along and I tripped over the computer. I tripped, bashing my computer and breaking it. Uh, yeah. I also remember I had a notepad document, which was numbers up to like 5,000 or something. That that was really good. And yeah, so after that, I decided to get a Windows 7. But sadly, it was the 299 one, 299 quid one. It did not last. So we purchased a 399 brand new Windows 8 for Christmas. That was basically the computer I'm still using today. Later on that year, we purchased another Windows 7, the one that I use most of the time. Well, sometimes. And yeah, that is the history. But okay, it is October the 2nd, 2014. I get a lot more into YouTube. And can we just go back further than this? Okay, it is. Oh my god, that was a lot of clap. December of 2013. I created my first ever YouTube channel. Gamer Guy. That channel sucked. Okay? So then, I made a channel called Epic Sass Videos. That sucked too. Ah! Then I made a channel called. Classic one. Saponables Channel. This is my very old channel and I did not take anything seriously. I got little to no views. How's that? Most of the videos will get about mm, maybe from 15 reviews if I was lucky. Normally about two, two, three views. So yeah, that wasn't doing really good. So um, created a channel called Bubblegum Blizzard. And I deleted that because uh, I was just really mad at that time and the way to take it out in the world was to leave my YouTube channel. I was really I was taking it on myself. Then I created the YouTube channel iZombie. I wasn't taking that seriously. I decided we need to get a new step so I created the channel that you're watching this one right now. Team Acid. And then today Louise and Emma joined 
and today I created my own channel, Assyrian Zombie. Link to that in the description. Link to Emma's channel in the description, and link to Louise's channel in the description. So that is the history of my life. So yeah, my life was very short. <laughs> so everyone, all I need to say is thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next episode. This will be uploaded on. A Sidian zombie and Teen Arthur. So, my lovely Sidians, I'll see you next. In fact, I'll see you tomorrow when I'm recording. When I'm vlogging. Bye.